Hello everyone, I'm Jimmy and welcome back to the Jimmy in the Wild channel for another great adventure. Before we get to the good stuff, please click that big red subscribe button so you don't miss a single episode of the upcoming Outdoor Fun. And if you like the video, be sure to hit the thumbs up button. Also, I'd appreciate any comments that you'd like to leave. Anyway, for today's episode, I headed to another great deep rugged canyon creek. I haven't been here for at least 15 years, so I thought it was time to get back up here and check it out. I first fished this part of the creek with my grandma and grandpa Kirsting when I was in fourth grade. Back then it was about 95% brook trout, but I think the most common fish in the creek today is rainbow trout. Many people wear waders here and just wade down the middle of the creek. It can get pretty miserable if you hike in wet hiking boots or shoes. On my hike, I wore hiking boots and managed to stay dry for the whole day. I found the best places to cross the creek and I often walked about 30 to 50 feet up the bank from the high water mark. There we go, that's a nice fish. Let's see if it's a brown or a brookie. No, a rainbow. I was incorrect. There he is. He is in the water. We got raspberries. It's one of my favorite times of the year when you come across these. About 100% ripe. Good enough. Mm. It's a good one. Oh, look at that guy. It's a big trout. You can see him right down on the edge of this rock. Let's see if he's a brown. Well, it's just another rainbow. Looking rainbows everywhere. There we go. He might be 10-ish inches. Just a nice rainbow. All the fins are there. Beautiful fish. We're gonna throw him back in. There he goes. Perfect. I don't know if you can see it on the camera. That is just completely filled with him. Not quite as spooky as the fish upstream, but they're a little spooky. So we'll go downstream some more. Hmm, he's a fighter. What is he? Another rainbow, I think. Seems to be all we're catching. Just these little rainbows. Most of them look natural. She might be eight inches, seven inches more likely. Let's get her back in the water so she survives. Get them back in the water as quick as you can. Oh, there we go, that's bigger. Maybe a brown. There's another rain. Oh, it looks like a brown this time. Oh, a brookie. I'm incorrect again. This is my first brookie of the day. He's pretty. A little bit bigger than that rainbow. Maybe a little over eight inches, just barely. When you get the opportunity, take it. Whew, that guy. Another one of these rainbows, I think. Yep, it might be the bigger one, or no, he's about the same size as that earlier large one I caught. It's a she. She's been through one spawning cycle. We'll get her in here. Throw her back. Yeah, usually only get one chance in the pool. That was my chance at that pool, I believe. Got. It's a brookie, but I'm not sure. Maybe just a bow. Oh, it's a brookie. Nice male. Maybe the browns have been taken out. All kept. Retained as somebody's limit. I don't know. This guy's ancient, though. He's a very old brook trout. Huge head, small body. Eight inches, but beautiful fish. Oh yeah, there we go. Bigger. Brookie. Pretty bricky. There he goes. 
That is a nice fish. Very beautiful fish. I'm gonna throw them back in the water here. There we go, there's a fighter. What is he? Another rainbow? Kind of looks like a rainbow. Looking for a big trophy fish, this is not it. Man, look at all those rainbows. Look at them all. They're stacked up in there. So this is the access point. The landowner has given the Game and Fish permission to post this sign, allowing people to walk in and fish. And you got to stay within 50 feet of the creek. That's pretty cool. Kind of nice that we've got that. Let people know where the boundary is. Looks pretty good. Well, that's a nice one, whatever it is. It's probably a rainbow. Bring him up over here. Could be a brookie. Oh, it is a brookie. Excellent. This is like the, maybe the fourth brookie we've actually hooked today that we know we've hooked. Not a giant. Eight-ish inches. That's the extent, extent of the brook trout in this creek, about this big. Really nice though. Got one. He's a tugger. Oh, it's a brookie too. Not a big guy. Oh wait. No, it is the first brown out of the water today. All right, so there's the first first brown trout of the day. Really pretty guy. Well, we almost had another one, but this is the only one I've gotten out of the water so far. First one. Nice fish. Another rainbow. He's a fighter. It's full of it. Oh yeah. Another bow. Pretty bow too. Look at that guy. So vivid. There he is. Look at that fish. Oh my goodness. Here we go. There we go. Got something. Woohoo! Oh, he came off. It's quite spectacular though, isn't it? More raspberries. Oh, beautiful patch of raspberries. Look at this bonus. Got some really nice ones. Well, that was a nice fish. Pull them right up and out of there. I think it's just a rainbow again. Yep, just a little guy. But here he is. This is what they are. Let me get him out. It's a little female. She's really pretty. Let her go. In a deep spot. She's good. Ooh. There we go. Thought about it. Thought about it long enough. It was, seemed like a good idea. Here she is. Look how beautiful she is. She's so small. She's good. Microfish. Oh. Microfish in the dirt. Hold on, little buddy. Here's the smallest fish of the day. Brookie. My adventure. Oh, that's just the boundary. Let me let their shirt. Is that what it is? Ooh, big one. Yeah. Oh, not super big. Pretty though, wow. It's the darkest rainbow of the day. He is almost black. 
Look at that guy. Whew. Gorgeous fish. Get him back in the water. Get a good angle on this hole. Let's see if we can get something out of here. Oh yeah. Another one of these rainbows. They're so full of it. We've got some shoulders on her. So when I say shoulders, it means they just have a little bit more meat there. They can really pull your line. It's like having bigger biceps or triceps or pecs. You can lift more. Well, these guys can pull more. There we go, getting a little rainbow. This tugger is a tugging fish. Fish on, fish on, woohoo! Okay, it's the same size as I've always got out of here. No monsters. So out of this creek, anything over 14, 15 inches is a, a monster. And here's a little female rainbow. She's running nine and a half, 10 inches. Oh, I'm gonna stink all the way home now. Thank you, fish. So here she is. Wiggly, slimy, beautiful little female rainbow. Get her back in the water. Let's see if we got under the log. Got some. It's always a gobbit fish in there. Like that guy. Woohoo! Nice bow. Oh, he's a jumper. Pretty sure it's female. All right, get back here, Wiggly. There she is. She's gonna go back in the creek. Is that a brookie? Yep, it's a brookie. Maybe the fifth or sixth brookie we've caught today. So. There's a nice one. He's on there. Pretty, pretty. Oh, pretty little rainbow. There she is, another female rainbow trout. Let's get it back in the water. Don't want her to expire. There we go. Pulled one out of there at least. Better than pulling zero out. Another nice, pretty rainbow. Super dotted. Look at that guy. Whew, look at all those spots. Get in there, buddy. Another bow. Little guy. Lots of energy. Don't worry, buddy. I'm going to put you back in. She's got so many dots. Tough to tell until you stop wiggling. Here you go, buddy. a rainbow wiggler all right these guys are a dime a dozen there he is she there she is there she is nice little rainbow let's get her back in she's good it's a nice fish a tugger Could be my big fish of the day let's see what he is rookie no, nope, rainbow, just a colored up rainbow. Let's see, is he the big fish of the day? I think so, beefiest. Not the same length as that little female I caught earlier. But here he is, hold him by the gum. That is a nice fish. Get him back in here. It's far enough down, there's still a lot of fish. It's got a really good form. There we go. Nice one. There's a tugger. Just a big meaty fish for this creek. Looks like a male. Pretty fish. Oh my goodness. All the little dots on them, the big black splotches or par marks. There he goes. There we go. 
Another bow. A little fatty. Pretty colors, wow. Some of the colors on these fish. Look at that fish. Ooh. He's a cut though, you can see the slash under his chin. All right, there he is again. Get back in the water. Here we go, another nice rainbow trout. No shortage. There we go. Another nice one. This guy's got a nick out of his gill. I wonder if something tried to get him. Maybe it's hatchery. Maybe that's a hatchery mark. Well, after fishing for about six or seven hours and hiking maybe four and a half total miles in this rugged canyon, I decided to call it a day. Wyoming is usually a really dry place, but the humidity in the bottom of this canyon was some serious stuff. And I can tell you from today's experience that humidity will really wear you out if you're not used to it. I caught around four dozen or so fish. Most were rainbows, there were a few brookies and one was a brown trout. A really fun trip overall, but no huge fish. It's such a beautiful canyon, I'm gonna have to come back here again in the near future. And that's pretty much it for today's video. If you liked the video, please hit the thumbs up button. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel so you don't miss any of the upcoming episodes. Thank you for watching and I'll see you again real soon.